It is, uh, it did not rise at all, virtually nothing. But it doesn't smell earthy any as much. It almost smells like a sour smell, like a sourdough smell. So we got this. We're gonna do the same thing today. Today's the according to the, the routine that I'm following, today's the last day of fifty grams, water fifty grams. Uh, flour so I'm going to take out all but 25 grams of starter and then go ahead and feed it something from yesterday is I need to I'm going to take one of these Dr. Pepper bottle I mean uh, Coca-Cola bottles and dump all of the waste in that because I dumped it in the sink and it didn't create a mess in the sink but I had to use like a couple of paper towels to get it out because I don't want to run it down the drain so I'm going to dump all of it and all the the waste into here just uh, out of uh, cleanliness and laziness on my part so it's 368 grams and we want to take it down to 267 grams that'll leave 25 grams of starter and then we'll go from there Hopefully it's turning a corner or down below to 300. That way I'll have only about 30 more grams to go. And I'm keeping my hand dripping wet because that seems to be the way we keep, um, there we go. That seems to be the way to um, keep all this stuff from sticking. This stuff is glue. So I'll put the marker on there again. This process takes like 10 minutes. So it's not, it's very messy. And uh, it's about as messy as I thought it'd be. It takes about 10 minutes. It's not, uh, it gets goo everywhere. Uh, this jar is not exactly clean. Um, I am gonna wipe out the just the, the rim of it because it does collect and I did wash the jar off because it was just starting to get caked with all this stuff and you let this stuff dry, it's glue. So, the odor, I had some sourdough bread yesterday night for dinner, with dinner, and this is ballpark. It still smells a tiny bit earthy, but it's not, um, it doesn't smell like straight up dirt anymore. So put it back in the corner and I'll visit it tomorrow to feed it again.